Dad? <laughs> Alright. Oh, Christ, what are you doing here? Well, I, I wanted to wake you guys up. Oh. Hey. No, no. Everyone to wake us up. I'm still tired. From what? You know what? That's right. I'm sorry. That's why I thought, bastard. Rude? But, either way. So, uh, what was it, Harry? <laughs> well, um, I was thinking and I was wondering if, you know, we could, we could, um, try again? Well, you want to try using your quirk again? Yes, but not that. I mean, I would like to try going to school again. Really? Yeah. I mean, Grandma Inko is nice and all, but she's... Hmm. She seems a little tired. All the time. Damn, that's right. She has had to redo her whole sleep schedule since I came back, so that would make sense. Ugh. But are you sure, Eric? Because last time we tried school, we had to come pick you up. I promise I won't freak out again. Oh, what do you think, Nana? <laughs> You promise you won't let your quirk go out of control again? Yes. Okay, fine. We can try school again. But not the same school, because I, I don't want anyone messing with you. Thanks, Mom. What about you, Dad? Uh, I'm fine with it. Really? Of course. And besides, you need more kid friends, I, I guess. <sighs> or is this going to start uh, cutting into your, you know, training time? So, um, hmm. Let me think. Maybe if I... What are you doing? I'm trying to calculate it how much longer we should wait until I could deem her ready to start her first hunt. But, well, I'm, I'm ready now. If no, you're going to do some more training before that. You hear me? But, Dad, no buts. I have spoken. But, Dad, I have spoken. Hey, I'm just walking off. <laughs> <sighs> Mom, your your dad's the expert. Besides, I got some hero work to do as well. Your dad. <sighs> I said in ten class. I'm supposed to be doing some rescue training exercises or something. I never got why though. Isn't he still in general studies? Yes, but... Huh. Uh, I've uh, made some arrangements. Thanks to Nazu and me. <laughs> As I mentioned, Nantorino, recovery girl. We are pretty much uh, convinced Yagi to allow them to do this. But why is he such an ass? Language, young lady. I'm just saying. I don't know. Giving him that quirk must have really gone to his head. And I accept responsibility for that, definitely. <sighs> but... 
anything, go get dressed. And yeah, we'll see you at the <sighs> docking bay. As soon as we get down there, he's like, oh, he's. Uh, I can't help but feel like I'm forgetting something. What? Like, uh, the fact that you still haven't told your mom that you have a spaceship or something? Well, I, I plan on telling her. It's just not now. You know? <sighs> Whatever. I know you'll tell her when you feel like you uh, need to, but still, trust me, secrets are not a good thing to keep when it goes to the people you care about. Believe me. Huh. So you uh, know from experience. You could say that. <sighs> oh well. As soon as he's good, does go into his class. He's noticing that, yeah, everyone is eyeing him, and it's like, okay, what's going on? They start bombarding him with questions on how else they can make their quirks useful, which he is pretty much being annoyed, if not pissed. This, all right, class, we're gonna. We're about to get ready, so everyone on the bus. And as they're on the get on the bus, this is when Suku sees Bakugo again. And he is a lot more cocky here when it comes to him being as strong as he is. Yeah, it is not pleasant. However. It's not just him who has a stick of their asses. I'm talking about E uh, as well as A. Hey, you may not agree with me here. Even Ibarra is somewhat of an a-hole here. When she sees Bakugo actually talking shit to Izuku and the others, she's like, Come on, Kaski. It is, it is not their fault that they are not one of the chosen. Chosen, you say? Indeed. Uh, if only she was a part of a Yauja hunt. A what? <clears throat> Nothing. Is yeah. He's like trying his best. He's recalibrating his uh, goddess, making sure that, uh, though he is allowed to use his hero gear, he doesn't want to do anything that could lead permanent damage. I mean, he wants to do permanent damage, especially to Bakugo, but he's not allowed to, on fear of being placed under suspicion. But then, as they're getting there, Everyone talking about the quirks and everything. When they, if you thought it was bad, when the people talk, started talking shit to Izuku in his class, when he he said he wanted to go to UA in canon. When they get to Izuku, everyone who's not in his class seems shocked that he's quirkless, as well as hearing that. Yeah, he did his thing in the whole interest exam. Was it? What? How can how how are you able to do anything without a quirk? It's called skill. Yes, like I said, how are you able to do anything without a quirk? Quirks are not everything. Please. But before we can okay, retort, okay, we're here. 
Okay. Just get this whole thing over with as he... They his Gala start going haywire. He's starting to push the buttons. It's like, okay, so wait, wait, something's wrong here. Someone, try using your phone. Uh, you don't tell me what to do. You can go eat me. Still getting flashbacks. It's like, oh, damn it, Nala. Who? Nothing. <laughs> nothing. Nothing. I said nothing. I'm just like, okay. <clears throat> if anything, just trust me. Or are you? Um, okay. So she does. It's a flip phone. It's just like, uh, I have no signal. How many could you pour as fuck? Excuse me? M nothing. I'll go just say, I, I, I said nothing. <laughs> but then Sue tries. And then soon, after everyone tests out their cell phone for service, everyone's like, okay, how'd you know something was wrong? My god, let's... Uh, huh, whatever. Either way, what does this supposed to mean? Some, someone uh, is jamming the signal. Trying to make sure... So... Wait. Uh, as I was say, what... Are you sure we're the only ones who's supposed to be here? Well, all my supposed to be here, but he uh, got tired. Oh, you know, he'll work. Yeah, he's fucking reckless. Is what's wrong with him? What? Nothing. He's like, okay, so it's just supposed to be us, you, and thirteen, right? As he puts down his biomass. He, he starts scanning, and he's like, yeah, there's a lot of people in there. We cannot go in there. What, what are you talking about? I'm saying that there are people there. That's that's not possible. Bago want to be a bastard. So, yeah, so, uh, don't listen to him. He's quirkless. He, his opinion means nothing. Is he just burst open the doors, alerting the villains? Then Kurigiri shows up with Shigaraki and even more villains. Him looking back at Izuku is like, Lucky guess. As he goes in to unleash the cans of Wopass. In which he does particularly well until they bring in the no moves. Oh yes, I said new moves. There, there are more than just one this time. But their hyperspeed regeneration as well as their strength enhancers. It is not fair to Bakugo. He is getting jumped and beating the shit out of. He's using whatever power he can. It is not working. He is not strong enough. And Izuku, on one hand, he wants to help. But on the other hand, he just wants to watch this train wreck. As until, yeah, they send some villains over to their side of the stairs. Him having no choice but to retaliate. Remember, he doesn't want to, well, he does want to kill. But he is not allowed to. So he has to set his plasma casters to stun. And if one is... Hella curious, like, how are you doing that? As he's saying, like, uh, thank you, Hatsume. <laughs> what, are you getting sick? No, I, I think someone's talking about me. As Izuku is unleashing a lot of ammunition. I wanted to say something else, but I cannot. Oh, fear of me laughing too much. I was sure I could go to eat I was like, wait a minute, that's not right. How in the hell is he doing this shit? They just sick all the number on him after they beat Bakugo to near death. Vlad is busy dealing with other villains. Izuku seeing the brains and how similar they look. It's like, Okay, they're brain dead. Might as well. Him slicing their heads off. Shigaraki 
Corey Geary and everyone who was able to see that is like, damn, just, just, just damn, what, it was like, what, 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 what's wrong, for some reason you look like you, you, uh, I right, what, have you done this before, he's like, what, have you killed before, I used to be a hunter, well, technically I still am, but just as a hobby. No, 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 no. You, I'm talking about kill, kill. You, you have ended people's lives, haven't you? No, 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 no. Of course not. No. What kind of monster would I be? Is then she writes. Okay, we have no choice. What? Bring in the ultimate Nomu. As this big ass hulking. Mass of a Nomu shows up. It has four arms, as well as if you thought the one in canon, the UFC was a lot. This one has a special quirk. Yeah, let's just say muscular is not a part of the story anymore. Sorry, not sorry. This is like, he knows we're having more trouble with this one. He tries stabbing it in the brain. It breaks his <laughs> wrist blades. He tries cutting off and shooting at it. It doesn't work. It just regenerates what muscle with muscle fibers, and <laughs> it has plenty to spare. So Izuku has no choice but to go with a bare knuckle brawl. It not going so well. That is until this weird thing just falls from the sky and everyone's looking, oh god, what is it now? Jigoraki's like, wait, did we sit? Is that one of ours? It's like, no. As then it just, it just like, wait, that's a drop pod. As he sees a serial number, he's like, don't tell me. As, yeah. Out comes six. Yalja dogs. And would is a Finally I've been waiting for so long like, wait, what? As as soon as they see Izuku, they recognize him instantly because hell they have a you could say programmed to know exactly who their master is. Thank you, Lebo Lebowin DNA, in which they help him. And it's not pretty. Them using the Kraken's crack tentacles are actually wrapping around the poor, no mood, muscular limbs, effectively ripping them off terrifyingly. Though these still regenerate, it is not something you want to see. All the blood, all the limbs be starting to move out for your reflex. Everyone else, they're looking out in horror as Izuku, he's like, This is beautiful. They're still like, Dude, what is wrong with you? Tough childhood. Okay, that makes more sense. As time goes by, they're still ripping and tearing through the Nomu. It trying to fight them, but they work as a unit. They are Their teamwork is tight. There's no breaking their formations. And so Zuku just like, okay, show's over. Aim for the head. Which, as soon as they hear that for them, wrap around his arms and legs. The other two, wrap around the neck while Izuku watches as the razor sharp tentacles form, you could say, a makeshift chainsaw ripping through the muscle fibers and anything else that would be in the way. As Izuku, he is congratulating his Yaja dogs. Everyone else is throwing up, seeing all that blood, carnage, there's n nothing 
they will that is nothing they ever want to see if they actually say oh dear god what it, it, how are you okay with this what is going to kill us we know but damn this is when all my shows I was like okay I am here oh my god what is this so he's like um uh, villain, villain attack. <laughs>